Y'all made it back. Back at the house. Grandpa's over there looking at Bonanza. Is it loud enough, Poppy? Can you hear it? No, no, sir. Can you hear the TV? TV's alright. It's okay. Good. So that's the man that I admire the most. It's my grandpa. Show me what a real man is supposed to be. A man that takes care of his family no matter what. I love that man. But I'm not gonna bother him too much. You know, old folk, they just like to do their own thing. <laughs> oh, my potatoes. But I am gonna get started on just prepping my dinner for this evening. So I'ma do that, y'all. Oh, folks, in these sweets, I had showed my grandpa I had got him this pie. So I went to go check on him. I said, you okay? And I told him, oh, I think I want some pie. <laughs> and he's like, that's a whole damn pie. So I'm going to get it all ready for him. Of course, it's gonna have to sit a little bit, so. He can have whatever he wants, as far as I'm concerned. So, I'm gonna cut this open. We got the oven heating up while he's watching Bonanza. Already cut up my potatoes because we're gonna have mashed potatoes. I might do string beans again. Those string beans last night was hitting. And we're going to have strawberry steak. And he might not eat that, but I'm still going to cook dinner anyway. But we got to make sure he does eat. That's the main thing. All right, y'all. So I got the strawberry steak cooking. Pie is done. Grandpa wants his pie right now. <laughs> his pie and ice cream. He's gonna get his pie and ice cream. Your legs. 
This is definitely not a cooking video today, but I'm just trying to get everything prepared, making this gravy. So grandpa's resting now. It's bittersweet, y'all. Now that I had the chance to lay my eyes on him, it's hitting me. It's hitting and it's hurting. But God has the last say so. That's all I have to say. The Lord has the last say so. And no matter how strong you try to be, it's never easy. Never easy, especially those that took you and helped raise you. I tell y'all that all the time. My grandparents was a big part of my upbringing. Like my father wasn't in my life, but that man right there was there. He was that one that would knock you on your head with his knuckles when you did something bad, cuss you out. Want to whoop you, but he never whooped me. He'll just pop you or hit you like do one of these as if to tell you stop doing dumb shit, you know? But he's a part of who I am today. And it's hard. It really is hard. But just having him here. It's enough for me. It's enough for me. Um, so he just had his um, apple pie and ice cream. I'll see if he'll try to eat later. As I can see, he's not eating much at all. Um, but just got to get him to try to eat. So. You're never prepared for things like this. Um, no matter what form it may come in, you're never prepared. But once again, I thank God for them for help mold me into four days like this. So I love them. Um, and just seeing him. It's everything.